everyone, this is Honeywell and today I have some Sims 2 CC to show you. Uh, these are holiday roof lights and I absolutely love them. And they'll be available at Mod The Sims. Uh, pretty much the set is a... is Max's Meshes made into roof deco. So they attach to the roof edge like so. Um, because they're roof deco, you'll need a Seasons or higher expansion pack. And the set includes a, a straight piece for all your uh, straight roof edges. And then there's the half pieces, a left and right. To fill in like so and then there's also pieces um, for 45 degree roofs 35 degree uh, gabled and shed roofs and also a 15 degrees um, I wanted to include more than just the kind of like the standard 45 degrees so you can have some interesting roof lines uh, but I didn't want to include so many uh, that the set became overwhelming and I think uh, I think this is a, a nice mix of you could have a uh, varied roofs so not quite so boring um, this is a 45 degree roof, and it's made up of the peak portions, the left and right sides, and then the end caps. Um, here is a 35 degree roof. And you'll see uh, with the roof peaks, it's either a one tile roof peak like this one is, or it's two tile like this. If the gable is a two tile one, there is a left, and right peak option, oops. Um, and between those two, the smaller peak and the left and right uh, pieces, this will cover any size gable roof, which is a, uh, which is nice. And a right piece, and then you have that little piece that's hanging down there. And, uh, yeah. Let's see. Um, you have, uh, roof lights. Very pretty. Um, because these are roof deco, um, they'll, with the roofs off, all of this hides. So none of it is sticking up out of the air like what would happen if you used um, a wall hanging and kind of uh, used sheets to put them in position. Uh, with these right here, I included a 15 degree just because roofs, uh, whenever I use shed, uh, shed roofs for a porch or something or whatever this is, <laughs> um, they tend to be 15 degrees. So again, I wanted to cover as much as possible. Um, it's the same portion. It has the short peak, uh, the left peaks, but because the this is this is only part of the roof is showing. Um, I believe just using the right and left sides will cover all this. Yeah, and then again, oops, the little end piece there. more straight pieces I think uh, I think all of this should be pretty intuitive right I included all of the Maxis recolors with this which includes the the red and green lights and the multicolored lights 
I also, um, Tiffany and, and KJ just uploaded a house, houses to Mod The Sims, um, that had these octagonal roofs. Now, I can't do all of the roofs, like all of these pieces, just to do three degrees and all of this was like a gazillion pieces. Um, but I did include a small number of kind of do-it-yourself uh, pieces that you can use cheats to, to kind of puzzle into place. Now with this, you can put some uh, columns, some columns up in order to get a grid with the with the uh, roofs off, so it attaches to the uh, so it attaches to the uh, the grid system. You can uh, puzzle these into place to kind of give a give an effect that continues the lights. Uh, put these back up. Um, I mean, they don't fit it at all. But you might be okay with that. Again, it's not it's not necessary, but I don't know if uh, people are going to like these or not. But I just wanted to give you some options with those. I also included, so it has the, the do-it-yourself uh, roof piece. And again... Um, they'll stick up because they're not attached to the roof, but they are they're attached to the top of the wall. So again, in cutaway view, that'll hide for you. Uh, which is really nice. Um, along with this, so there's a kind of a do-it-yourself roof piece and that's just positioned for those octagonals. If you use the regular piece, it goes above the roof line. I also included a these are wall hangings, not roof deco. Um, so if you have, they're height adjustable if you have that cheat and you can use uh, all your standard build sheets for these. And that's what I use to frame the windows. Again, not needed, but for those people who like to do extra, <laughs> there's pieces for that. Uh, and again, the colors. Oh, the reefs. I didn't show you those. Uh, now, with the reefs, they attach to... to the gables and they kind of position themselves. If you don't like the way these are, because these windows are so tall, this kind of sits kind of too low. So I don't like that. What you can control how high or low these sit by changing the roof peaks. This is a 35 degree angle. So let's try, I don't know, 38 degrees. And that's better. And now you can lower it back to the original roof angle. Whoops, maybe. And you can make adjustments like that. Now with this right here, I put a light on these wreaths. Um, but they're funny. They don't always, they don't always work. And I found with the um, the roof peaks, they don't show up on anything, uh, anything above forty degrees. So you can do the same thing that we just did here: lower the roof angle, place the wreath, have the light show up, and then. Uh, adjust the the roof back again or you can just use an invisible light <laughs> and uh, and frankly that's what that's what I do um, I had I tested out putting lights on the lights just like I did with the reefs um, but it's it was too much by the time you have um, landscaping light, light that bleeds in through the windows, and then just other decorations. 
a lot of the Christmas decorations are lighted already. Um, it was just too much. Uh, so I recommend using invisible lights. NYX has a set on her site, so if you don't have any, I'll link to the link to them on the post so you can get those. Um, what else? Oh, again, using the uh, kind of cheats. If you just put these on regularly, you can't see them. But again, you, you changing the roof angle will change how high or low these sit on these. And this was a 45. Let's try 47. So we'll raise up the roof. Place a light and let's test this. It's usually one or two degrees works. And that is too high. It's kind of sticking up in the air. So let's take that off and let's do 46 degrees. And we'll try it again. Well, this is gonna have to work because we don't have another option. Yeah, that's better. Um, and then you can place the lights just like you would straight across, and then you have your left and right ends. Um, these, they look better from one side than the other. So if you have an angle that you're trying to like uh, have nice lights, pick which side you want. I don't think they look bad from any angle. Like once this is all covered, I think it looks nice regardless, you know, because pretty lights. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. I just wanted to show you really quick, uh, just because it's something a little bit new, uh, how these attached. Hopefully this didn't go on too long. And you, between this and the upload post, you have uh, all the information that you need. Thank you so much for watching, and if you download these, I hope you enjoy them. Bye-bye.